Hey, what's happening guys? Welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Evoland. In the last episode, we finally beat the Skeleton King after three tries. So, uh, three tries really is the charm, I think. Or whatever that expression is. And now we can go through this. Um, so, without further ado, let's go. Where I'm sure more enemies await us, or the amulet. It's the second part of the amulet. This is awesome. And there's another chest, it seems. What's over here? It's a portal. It's a town portal. Hey, this is... This is the town portal from Diablo. Like, they took this from Diablo, I'm pretty sure. But, uh, let's... Are we at full health? We're at full health. Um, but now we have enough uh, gliss. Let's buy the DVD player. Bye bye slow CD loading times, we won't regret you. More like forget, I think. Um, well, we don't need any more Phoenix down, I think. Do we? How many do we have? We have one Phoenix down. Okay, so we will buy some Phoenix down also. Like one... No, I, do. <laughs> I want to buy it. One Phoenix down, two Phoenix down, one, two, three potions. Oh, we got three Phoenix. Ah, uh, fine. Alright, let's go talk to Sid. Woo! That's the part was exciting. I think. Yeah, it probably was. Also for you guys, I think. Oh man, that was that was a one heck of a fight. And let's go. Hey Sid. Hi, weird arrow in the ass woman. Oh, crap. Uh, let's talk to him again. Ah, crap. Alright, well done. Now that you have the whole amulet, you can enter the Black Citadel. You will find it uh, to the east of Ogai, just past the river. Good luck. That's all? That's all? Uh, Alright, I'm fine with that. Whew, alright. I have the feeling this game is almost over. Because they said the evil was coming from the Black Citadel, and now we're going there. So, it must be almost over. Uh, but first... You! Uh, I want to... Beat you. Yes? Alright, this time I'm, I'm surely going to win. Nothing can beat me after, after, after the awesome victory in, in the last episode. Oh crap, I should have put that in the middle. Oh crap, he had a snake. Um, let's get it. I hate you. Uh, one and... Uh, yeah, let's put this here. That's the Undead King, by the way. We beat him uh, last episode. Um, I'm looking at it, but I'm not impressed. I wonder what happens if you... Well, I'm not going to risk losing again. You have a good feeling about the game, but I'm the one who's winning. Ah, oh, crap, it's a tie. No, I win. Awesome. <laughs> I beat you, old man. I kicked your ass. But let's go to the Black Citadel, I guess. The runes of blah blah blah. Thank you. And let's save and let's go. I'm sure this will be a long, long trip. But I'm feeling confident now. And we're back. That was a short fight. I want to know what's over here. And we're back again. A lot of random fights. I called it. That's all. Um, let's head to the Black Citadel. There are a lot of random encounters now. I wonder why. Like, seriously, I can't even speak a whole sentence. Alright, this is really, really ridiculous. This is impossible to commentate over. What's this? I guess we're at the Black Citadel. What's that? Is he an ally? So, this is you. 
You are the evil that's been ravaging my hometown. Huh. Just call me Zephyros. Really? Yeah, if, um, if that's not obvious, that's like a reference to Sephiroth, the Final Fantasy VII um, boss. You have come a long way to find me, but all of your efforts are in vain. Your ridiculous power is nothing compar compared to mine, and I'll prove it to you right now. So we have to fight him, like right now. All right. Oh, we don't do a lot of damage. Or do we? Nope. He does around 20 damage. Alright. Um, uh, why not? Let's see. I wanted to heal. So, um, this is a very disappointing final boss. If it's the final boss. Because I'm really not sure. I hope not. Because it's kind of disappointing until, uh, so far. It's like every un other random enemy encounter. And I wish he would attack Clink more, but it's like he's alternating between uh, Carries and, and Link. Uh, no, uh, Clink, I mean. But, uh, like, Clink has the most um, HP, so I really don't mind him attacking Clink. But I really wish he wouldn't attack Karis, because Karis is my healer. Uh, speaking of which, let's heal. So, how much HP does this dude have? Oh. That's enough! I'm tired of playing with you. Um, sorry? Come and No, you must be kidding me! No, 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 no! No, you're not doing that. No. Ah, me! Oh, god, no. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. I didn't see that. Oh, crap! Clink, potion, now. What? <laughs> you used it on Karis? Oh, wait, Karis is the one who needs healing. Oh, crap. No, don't heal him. Heal Karis. Who would heal? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Who would heal? Heal that dude? That's ridiculous. Unless it does damage to him or something. All right, let's continue to fight. And um, I should keep healing now because um, I doubt Karis or Clink. Well, especially Karis will survive another Kamehameha wave. Oh, there, let's heal, heal, heal. Uh, heal her. She needs it. And let's heal thing too, just for good measure. Awesome, we should survive this. Although Karis just survived this barely. Barely survives it. And let's attack him. Because we have to do some damage also. Uh, attack, I will use Karis' turn to heal. Right. Attack. Karis, you're on permanent healing duty. Like, seriously. Think you are on attacking duty. And Karis, ah, no, not again. Alright, potion time. Potion, potion, potion. Uh, Karis, oh no, no, Karis, Clink needs it. Oh, crap. Awesome. Okay, we're alright. I really wish wish we got another turn after the... Ah, oh, crap, Karis is down. Uh, we're not doing too well either. Uh, let's heal ourselves first. And then use a Phoenix down on Karis. And she's dead again. Alright, um, no. Um, screw Karis. I'm just going to heal myself now. Except I don't have any uh, many potions anymore. 
Oh no, you don't. Oh, this is bad. I have the feeling I'm going to die. 62. That's not too bad, I think. Item, potion, use it. Alright, last potion. Uh, I have the feeling I won't survive this fight. Come on. Alright. Um, I'm going down after one more attack. Yeah. Crap. Wait! Oh, no! Oh, it's... No. Oh. We will not surrender! We will fight you until we die! So be it. Um, what? You... You killed her! Like... Hey, wait a minute! This is like Final Fantasy all over again! Karis, thank you. You were always there for me. Always there to protect me. Always there to fight with me. Please promise. Please pr promise tell you will fight on. Sure. Please give us back our green land. I'll be watching over you. I... I what? No. <laughs> if that's going to bounce... Oh. All right. Damn you, Zephyr Ross! You got awakened power. Your special power has awakened. Heal Bahamut. Well, let's do Bahamut. What's Bahamut? Ooh, fancy. Ooh, it's a dragon type thing. The fuck are you? But this is awesome, and that's totally a Final Fantasy VII reference. Seriously, you think you've beaten me? I'll head back to the mana tree. And when my wounds are healed, I will destroy this world you like so much. Ah, alright. Yeah, total Final Fantasy reference. You have won 2000 bliss and 58 XP. Um, um, let's go back. Karis is dead, damn it. Ooh, we have a mini map. Why didn't I see that? I never noticed the mini map. And I totally should have seen that coming, with uh, Clink getting the Buster Sword and uh, the the woman named Karis. Uh, yes, I need healing. And what did you say? You must go to the Mana Tree and avenge Karis. No, I don't need healing. How did you know she died? Um, let's buy a shitload of potions. I don't think we will need any more Phoenix Downs. Okay, let's continue buying them. Because I have the strong suspicion I will need a buttload of potions. Like, a really big buttload of potions. Let's waste all, all our money. You know what, this is enough. We've got 33 potions. Awesome. Alright, let's go break the news to Sid, I guess. Carries is dead. Like, dead. It's impossible for one to get more dead than her. Karis may not be of this world anymore, but I can still feel her presence. I know she is with Clink. Her power will stay with him forever. I can't believe Karis is dead. This is a very sad day in the history of Ogai. This is not in vain, though. She gave her powers to Clink so that he can save the world. Now you are our only hope to, to defeat Zephyros. With the power of Karis, you will be strong enough. I believe in you. We all believe in you. Come and see me, one, <laughs> when you have some time. I might be able, able to help. What do you have to say? We're all doomed! <laughs> oh, there's always one pessimist. Dot, dot, dot. So most of us believe in you. That's pretty good, isn't it? I guess. 
That's good enough. I believe Karis did not die in vain. Clink, you must go to the Mana Tree and defeat Sephiroth, once and for all. I'll give you my airship. It's the only way to reach the Mana Tree. The fate of the world is in your hands now, Clink. We got an airship! Awesome! Tired of walking, Air Evo Land welcomes you on board. But first, let's talk to the guard. He said he might be of use. So, let's talk to him. Hey, are you looking for any advice? Many stars are hidden in different places all over Evolandia, but only great adventurers are able to find them all. So far you have found 16 out of 30 hidden stars. I was told the stars hidden in the crystal caves. Where are the crystal caves? Do you play double twin? You need to get more cards to become a champion. So far you have found 14 out of 30, uh, 23 cards. I'm pretty sure that, card, that a card is hidden in the hidden cave. Uh, I, when I was young, many traveling merchants were coming to Ogai. With the waste uh, spreading, nobody comes here anymore. However, I recently heard that a merchant has set up his shop into the northwest forest. Maybe he's selling some nice items. Chocobos? They are kind of big yellow birds. They live in the plains in the north. Be careful not to be hurt. They have very pointy tusks. Their cooked meat is actually delicious. I think someone in Ogai knows how to prepare it. Alright, so apparently there is a hidden cave somewhere and also a merchant and stuff. But we will figure it out uh, in the next part. So, thank you for watching. Uh, if you haven't, please consider subscribing. Uh, if you like this video, like it. And I will see you guys in the next part. See you then.